So why is it called the Horrible Horseshoe? The Horrible Horseshoe got its name from the shape of holes three, four, and five making a route around a practice range. The word horrible is because they are the three hardest holes on the golf course, statistically and mentally and physically. <laughs> Challenges to play the, the three hole horrible horseshoe six times for a, an 18 hole total. And we're gonna see how accurate the adjective horrible really is. 483, par four. 247, par three. <laughs> the driver. 481, par four. Par 66. Uh, What's a good score? Bogey golf is 80, what, 84? 80, I, if you offered me bo bogey golf right now, I would take it. Yeah, that'd be great. Gladly go get a beer in the clubhouse. Let's do it. All right. 241 to the flag. Sick. That's gonna be a re-fire. Now we know what it's got, you know? Hey! <laughs> it was terrible. It wasn't fun. It just requires a lot of intestinal and mental fortitude, which, which I don't have. I didn't really have. We had some bright spots, though. We did. You, you putted pretty well. Perked up there in the second loop. You had a great chip in for birdie. Yeah, only bird of the day, which I'm glad we got one, right? I know. Um, it's yeah, it's just tough. tough. It's just tough. Got it. Yeah, I'm changing up the strategy. I'm going to intentionally play short, hopefully right in the middle of the fairway. So you're laying up? Yeah. yeah I'm laying up. All right, sick visor. I declare it unplayable. They say it's a short course comparative to everything else. I didn't feel that way at all from the tips. No. You know, we've been playing the member tees with strapped, unless we have sanctions. And right. Yeah, I, mean, it's I think fun. it's like, hey man, if we make it too many birdies, we'll scoot back. But yeah, if I had to play, of, it's out of my league. If I had to play the tips like this for golf, I would quit the game. Like I don't need that in my life. It's brighter than our cameras make it look. That one got out of hand quick. It's golf's version of the pool hall a little bit. The, the way the greens roll, it's like whenever you go play in a pool hall and they have those big long tables and you have tons of like long corner shots where you're like, wow, there's a ton of felt here. I have to hit this to get the, it's no, there's, it you just, just have to be so precise yeah. so often. And, and then if I, if I don't hit these long corner shots well, they're gonna, you know, it's gonna run like crazy and bounce off three walls. So the, the leaves are always really bad. Yeah. And, it, and with pool, you're always trying to leave it in the right spots. And I feel like around here, it was similar, where a lot of felt <laughs> to cover, and the ball would roll out to spots you didn't want to be in on the short side a lot. Punishment. This is yeah. punishment golf. Totally joyless. Uh, give me some numbers. Okay, so the damage. Uh, so this, you know, essentially a par 66. Neil shot an 88, the 22 over. That's what I, oh. I, I was kind of my over under going in. And I shot a 94, which is 28 over. He's done it! Yes! <laughs> Yes, huge finish right there, bud. It's always a pleasure playing with you, brother. Man. Always a pleasure. You know what, I got beat up, but I made it all six rounds. So how's that, Colonial? Thanks for having us out, guys. Well, let's get out of here, guys. Mr. Here. Hogan. Mr. Hogan. You're a real mensch, you know that? You have a, you have a stern test. <laughs>